Today, Baton Rouge was ground zero in the fight over President Bush's energy policy and his efforts to change the Clean Air Act. Marvin McGraw takes us to an EPA hearing that drew protesters from around the nation. Environmentalists claim President Bush is trying to gut the Clean Air Act. We're here to let President Bush know that his energy plan makes the wrong choices. By proposing to relax some air pollution standards for oil refineries and coal burning utility plants. Today, they aired their feelings before an EPA panel. We are not trying to deny the right of energy companies to do their business. We are simply saying they have to follow the law like the rest of us. The president ordered the hearings in the wake of his efforts to ease the energy crunch. Industry representatives claim the nation is suffering a refinery crisis, partly due to environmental regulations, which make expanding their plants both difficult and expensive. The refiners have looked to maybe uh, undertaken projects that would actually lower emissions, but would have to go through a 12 to 18 month review process, and they, so they decide not to do it. Chittam says the president's decision could have a big economic impact here in Louisiana, where one out of every six barrels of oil in the United States is refined. But environmentalists argue that any changes will increase pollution and affect the health of many who live near the refineries. The EPA will make a recommendation to President Bush next month. I'm Arvin McGraw, News 2, Louisiana.